In this Libre Time tutorial, I will show you how to add a random underwriting spot following every top of the hour ID to provide acknowledgement to supporters of your station. Underwriting is a term derived from non-commercial licensed radio in the United States and typically needs to avoid calls to action as well as mentioning of prices. Be sure to check with whatever regulatory authority, if anyone, dictates how you can record underwriting. For web streams, there generally aren't any regulations that I'm aware of. So the idea here is that if you already have a top of the hour station ID set up with an intro playlist, if you missed this tutorial, it may be helpful to watch this other one first, or you can follow along either way. I will do that real quickly. So we'll create a playlist. We'll call it intro playlist. PlayStation ID. The underwriting setup is based upon the idea that you want to select a random underwriting announcement from a single underwriter at the top of every hour. Every time an underwriter is added to the pool, they have an equal chance of getting aired. If you're making promises to your underwriters that they will have their spots aired a certain number of times or during certain times of the day, you will need to do this more manually by editing the individual show's auto-loading playlists and adding the underwriting announcements. Or if you have DJs manually uploading the tracks or streaming live, they'll have to make that announcement themselves or mention it on air while they are doing their show. For the purposes of this tutorial, we're going to create a smart block called underwriting and then the genre will be set to underwriting. Okay, so just a note that the genre and everything is case sensitive on the matching. So you may want to use all lowercase when you are doing this, but for the purposes of this demo, I did it all as caps when I uploaded the track, so keep that in mind. Okay, we'll limit it to one item and then we'll preview it. There's only one underwriting announcement set up, so then we're going to exit it, save it, and close this. Okay, now we will go and add the intro playlist that we set up earlier. Since I didn't set up this particular one with the auto playlist, we'll go here, show you real quick. Again, auto playlist, intro playlist, save. If this is going too fast, you can go back and watch the previous one. So now we're going to go to playlists. We have our intro playlist here. And what we're going to do is we're going to add the underwriting smart block to immediately follow our station ID. Your intro playlist should probably start with some kind of station ID, be it legal or otherwise, followed by an underwriting. So that's how it's set up. And we already went into the playlist settings to now, basically, every show that has an auto-loading playlist will start with a station ID followed by a random underwriting spot and then the content. You can increase the number of spots that are aired by going in here. So say if you wanted to do two underwriting spots at the top of every hour, you could do that. Now it only will show one because we don't want to have repeated underwriting, most likely. Okay, we're finding additional features such as individualized intro playlists for specific shows and a log where you can look up all the times that a track aired in the past. This could be useful for sharing with your underwriters. If you're a web radio, commercial radio station, then you could use this to track ads. Additional functionality is planned, so keep checking the forum at discourse.libretime.org, our website, or our GitHub repo at github.com slash libretime libretime. All right, and thanks for tuning in. Hope this was helpful.